EFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here on this very first day of December, December 1, Friday. Tiger Financial News Network, 10 a.m. market update. The Dow is up 68, making a new recovery high. Look at this monthly chart because it's made a new high. It means all of December, this is leg C. No matter, even if I had to plunge 2,000 points, it would still be a leg C. Uh, the S&P so far is a little different. So the S&P uh, trading right now down two at 45.65, uh, made a peak E at 45.87. 0.63 three sessions ago. So, so far, that's still only a peak C in the monthly chart from a few months ago. We haven't broken above that 4607 level. Uh, so, we're watching that quite closely. It's just a just an eye blink away. QQQ, NDX 100, same thing. Made a peak E um, in Chubb Wave methodology three days ago. It's under that right now, but it did make a new recovery high last month. And so far, uh, this will be a peak B if there's no new high above 39 or oh, 394. I should have typed that in uh, 14, uh, but uh, I think there will be. Meantime, that is a leg B in the monthly, and so far it's down $1.17 in the uh, daily chart. IWM, the Russell 2000 small caps, are they starting to find a bit? Yes, they're up 81 at 180.47, right on the 200 period exponential moving average. Looking at the SMHs, we need to look at that because they did pull back some over the last couple of days. Down 40 cents right now at 160.07. Not really participating the way the others have. Now we're going to go to gold. Gold is up nine at 2066. <clears throat> and this is going to be very important because the, the gold is up while the dollar <clears throat> has made a new recovery high from yesterday. So the dollar's got a little bit of a bounce going on right now. That's kind of important. Uh, but it's also important that gold is showing its own independent strength. You're looking at the TLT, they kind of go together. TLT is pulling back. It's actually up 13 cents at 91.71, but pulling back from three days ago, still holding very well. That means the yields are kind of up there. Looking at the uh, crude oil, crude oil is up uh, 60 cents. There's a lot to discuss since I return for the Tiger Technicians Hour, and we'll see where the markets are and what we need to be looking at for next week. I'll be back in a moment. Basil Chapman, I get to finish this out. Check out both Nick or Baby Snap.